Hello friends, welcome to BSV Solution. My name is Lokesh Gandhi. In our today's session, we are going to configure sort and receive rules in Oracle Fusion WMS Cloud. In the warehouse management system, sort and receive is typically used to separate the content of an LPN in a shipment by store keeping unit, purchase order, or some special criteria. The sort and receive options helps you to scan each unit of an the SN and determine how to sort the item based on the rule configured in our WMS application. You can examine each and every item and sort it according to configurable rule in different TOTS. And basically TOTS are used in industry for transporting or storing the materials. In logistic, the TOT is a container that used to transport or store a large volume of liquid, semi-solids or solids. And you can also get an opportunity to mark the item being received as a damage or not. So the sort and receive configure header provides you the ability to outline the pattern which you want to sort and receive the store keeping unit in our warehouse. So let's move to the instance and we'll see how to configure the sort and receive rule adder in our instance. So this is the warehouse instance and we have to search the keyword sort and receive configuration. Right. So we are going to create new one. So click on create and we have some fields. So start from the receive station. So we have to enter the receiving station from where you want to bring the item from. So let's select the third one, right? And uh, we have the second one has criteria one and third one is criteria two. So in the first one, we have to define the rules by selecting from the drop down box. We have the uh, options. We have so many options for criteria for this configuration, like item, inbound shipment, and we have the inbound shipment, right? So we are going to create the rules for the criteria item code. So we have to select the item code for the first criteria. And the criteria two, we are going to select item description, right? So we can define an additional criteria for the criteria two. And uh, we have the condition. We have the three type of condition, non-empty first, matching either, and match all. For the non-empty first, if the value is blank in the criteria field one, then try to match the value from the criteria field two. This is for the non-empty first, right? When we select the match either, if either one of the column value match with the criteria one at criteria two, then the corresponding dot is fetch. And for the match all, the value from the criteria one column and the value from the criteria two is match. Both are match to get a corresponding dot, right? So we have the three type of the condition. Go with the as per your requirement. So let's select first one, non-empty first, right? And uh, we have the break rule. We can define and we can select close LPN location, right? So enter the drop location to where you want to locate your item. So let's select by the search icon. Let's search. And you can select and OK. Right. 
so this is the mandatory fields and you can define let's click on save so you can see you here our configuration gets created over here right now we can define the break rules for this configuration the break rules allows you to create the break rules and associate the rules details with the criteria you specify so i am going to create the break rule for this configuration and if the associated break criteria value is reached you will be promoted to the and the dot and it is not mandatory to configure the break rule if the sort break rules is not configured the system does not do any validation for closing the dot you will have to end the dot manually through the rf program so let's create one break rule for this configuration so select the configuration and click on this break rules so click on this create so let's define rule name and rule description for this configuration so item and the break rule for the items right click on save so this is how you can create the break rules and you can configure many break rules as you like right so go to the sort and receive configuration so this is how you can create sort and receive rules in our wms cloud so thanks for watching this video thank you so much